Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Gigi is back. I hope everybody's had themselves a wonderful night last night. I, yeah, after I was done stream, I went for a nap, then got up, made some, uh, well, no, what did I do? Uh, after stream yesterday, no, I par, par fried some fries, and then, yeah, then I went for a nap, then I woke up, then I made the fries and smash burgers. <coughs> Excuse me. Went to bed, and then, yeah, I ended up just coughing most of the night, so oh, my back is killing me today i'm in a full flare but uh i had to get up and move around and do something so i was like you know what we're just going to kick back relax unwind with the stream so i ripped that up so that's why the uh the thumb or the um notification was kind of late for coming through so my apologies as always thank you so much uh reap eden spider for being here for being the early birdies you too bud you're probably lurking in the background getting yourself another coffee <laughs> but uh yeah other than that though i can't complain i got caveman coming oh and reminder tomorrow there probably uh won't be a stream as i gotta go out i gotta go get uh some groceries for the the month and then uh some disinfectant stuff and that and then i'm going to be just mega washing the house down making sure that kiddo doesn't have any chance of getting sick so it's actually probably a good thing looking at my desk. Yeah, ooh, top of the speaker. Well, you guys won't be able to see it, but it's just filled with dust. <laughs> it's been a while since I cleaned up with that, uh, with here, or uh, cleaned up my desk. So probably be a good idea to give her a good wipe down in that anyway. Oh, bud might not be up yet. Gotcha, gotcha. Can't blame him, you know, if you had a late night working on something and that, yeah. Can't blame at all. So, uh, yeah, there was an update. Uh, you guys let me know yesterday that there was an update for this. So I went and checked it out. And actually, it's it's not a bad update. It's just not a very uh, big update is the best way that I could say. It. It's uh, they, They've updated with a, a jerry can. <laughs> uh, that's the update list, folks. It's just there's a jerry can in here. But I want to go check it out and see how it all works. Uh, the, it does have more information though. It says upcoming update work has begun on a major upgrade an expanded club building, new furniture, new items, new events, new NPCs, new club system will be added. And then he drops down some images of the upcoming update. And it looks like there is a uh, steering wheel and pedal set that you can get for your shop. And it looks like, uh, different colors of some, uh, PC PSPs. So, all right, I'm ready. You guys ready? Let's, uh, let's jump into the game. Or as the, the title of the song is that you just heard, uh, Get Back in the Game. All right, you know what? Actually, we are going to play some music in this one here. Uh, let me just uh, just turn that down just a little bit. There we go. Uh, so here we are in our house. Uh, we last left off. We got ourselves uh, our own home PC. And uh, the only problem is, is that it doesn't work. Whoa, what happened there? It just like teleported me over. Uh, yeah, see, I'm trying to turn it on. And it's not, like, it turns on, but the computer monitor isn't worked out. You don't see that little emblem down here on the desk, so. Ah, uh, that, that wasn't added. Dang it, I hope that, uh, I hope that really does get added. <laughs> we'll take that, we'll have ourselves a, a drink or three. Boy, he's a little bit loud, isn't he? Don't, uh, don't be drinking into the microphone, pal. <laughs> don't you know the, uh, proper etiquette? Drink sideways. Dr. Pepper, not a sponsor, should be, but it's filled with water. I can't stand buying those plastic reusable jugs. The things are so small. You drink them in like 15 minutes. It's like, what's the point? I mean, how are you supposed to stay hydrated with just, you know, it's like, <laughs> if I want to drink something that small, I'll get a teacup for heaven's sakes. Uh, let's take a look and see our needs. Oh, actually, all right on. We don't have to pee. Uh... Every once in a while, it, my view just gets glitched. Just kind of whips around. Come on, open. Uh, we'll take you. And you. That should take care of our food for a bit. Excellent. All right. Uh, now, I just copied the, the jerry can. <laughs> <laughs> from the, the screenshot so i have no idea where we got to go get it so i'm going to take a here i'll close the door for everybody that's been telling me hey you'd keep driving with your door open uh, but yeah let's go let's go to the gas station 
Let's see if we get to buy it from the clerk. And if it's not there, then we'll go try the, the store. How's our temperatures doing? Temperatures looking okay. Oil is a little low. But, hold on, no. Oil's on the left, isn't it? Yeah, oil's on the left. Temperature's on the right. And what side is the gas tank on? I think it's on the right side. Alright, so we can probably put in about uh, 10 liters worth. Come on. Ah. Thank you. I keep forgetting that you can hit the um, space keys to break. Sweet. Here we go, though. Uh, oh, yeah, it's over here on the side. I was thinking of that uh, Route 66 there. How you doing, pal? I want to... Oh, okay. I was hoping that there'd be a jerry can. You fill up a jerry can preemptively, maybe. But, uh... Alright, well, we'll just get 10 liters. Well, that was really quick. But $2 a liter. <laughs> Real prices these days. Close that up. So he doesn't have the gas can... Uh, yeah, the heck with this. Hold on. I know what we're going to do. We're going to get ourselves some more Dr. Peppers. Petters. Dr. Petters. My bad. Oops. Uh, I'll take all your hot dogs, mister. And then I'll take all your Dr. Peppers, sir. Whoa, that was not supposed to happen. All right. Uh, I'm going to have to come back for, for one of you guys. Yep. Actually, you know what? We deserve to treat ourselves once in a while. <sighs> Another episode of Vending Machine Simulator. It will be pretty close to that here in a minute. Uh, I got a tip for everybody on, uh, on how to make your lives a little bit easier with the, uh, the vending machines. So, you remember how I was saying that, oh, I'd love to be able to just put, you know, a vending machine outside and have the, uh, the NPCs use it? Well, one of our awesome viewers mentioned, he's like, oh, hey, the vending machines don't work outside, but you could do something. And he proceeded to explain what I'm about to show. So, no, this is not my original idea. No, I'm just, uh, I'm passing along the information for everybody. Church. All right. Oh, I even see it right there. I'm pointing at it even. Right on. Okay. Uh, all right. Open the door. Turn off the ignition. Out we go. Oh, the game is so needy. Right here. All right. Purchase, please. And you had to give me a basket for a jerry can? Do you not know the use of what a jerry... Blah! And you... Ugh. <laughs> you pick up the basket and the jerry can stays on the counter anyway. What the, what's the point of the basket? <laughs> oh. Oh, all right. Well, this isn't one of my demos, so it's not a it's not a tear down video. So I've decided to name the my demos and that of games. I'm going to call them tear downs. You know, just so people have more of an understanding of where I'm coming from in them. You know, it's like, I don't come from an area of hate. I come from an area of disappointment. I want the games to be built beautifully. All right, let's just try something. Hold on. Open. Aha, canister is empty. All right. Ha ha. Are you going to... Whoa, dude! Are you all right? Is your name David Copperfield? Whoa. Or is my world just an illusion? Am I in the Matrix? Yeah, free basket. Yeah, but I'm always tossing the baskets out. I just, I keep getting so many. I mean, they're worse than the, uh, the, the plastic shopping bags. You know what I mean? All right, let's see how we do this. Ah, oh, whoops. Right, I got to hold it.
Aha. Uh -huh. There we go. Uh. Oh, no, car, you're in my way. Uh oh. I, I ain't seen the amount of, uh, leaders. Uh, let's put in 10 just to see what happens. took it all right let's let's try another 10 see what happens oh, I can't talk to your back huh pal for science huh let's put another 10 <laughs> hmm does this hold more than our cars tank let's find out The column is currently busy. Okay, so it looks like... Hold on, let's see maybe if we put in 5 liters. Yeah, so it looks like 20 liters is what the uh, canister takes. Oop. There we go. Uh. Hmm. I don't want to rotate it right or left. I want to rotate it flat so it fits. But whatever. Oop. Come on. R. R. Thank you. Hmm. All right. Let us go. Back to the gaming club. Yeah, the... J Jeremy, hey! I don't know. How did I miss your name in there? Oh, because you have the same J as, uh, as Jack the Reap. That is why. Jack the Reaper. Okay, gotcha. Now I understand. Because I do a lot of things via Avatar. I don't really read that much. <laughs> oh, come on. Quit turning around like that on me, would you? Just scrape a little bit of paint there. We're good. It's been a while since we played. Oh, whoops. I forgot to close the door again. My bad. Here, I'll close the door now for you folks. <laughs> All right. So, what the message was is you get yourself two vending machines, right? You fill them both up. And then when one gets emptied, you take the other one and you swap it out. And then you can fill it up again so you constantly, constantly have a supply Oh, do I have to press X? Yeah, that's what it was. So you have a full machine in your uh, in your club at all times. And I thought that was a heck of a genius idea. Uh, F, turn. All right, so this one here, we got ourselves our chocolate bars. We got what's called... What was that called again? Marmalades. We got some Sprites. We got some juices. We got some... Uh, is that ramen? Yeah, we'll call that ramen. And some Spam. Then what you do is you just pick this up. And you can put it back in your... Whoop. In your club. No, no issue. Come on. And I bet you my computer isn't even turned on. Dang it! I keep forgetting about that. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I want to turn you on. In a power kind of way. Alright, let's uh, get rid of the taking and let's turn on with it. Now, let's just... What do you mean like... Oh, uh, because that guy grabbed it, didn't he? Okay, well this guy's going to do the same thing. Yep. Dang it! Dang it! Oh, no, we're in. Okay, phew! Let's see, do we have any antiviruses? Nope, 13 days left. Do we need to clean anything up? Oh, a little bit. All right. Uh, all the chores of owning a business, I tell you. Oh, somebody wants to go on that one now. Must be made of money. I just leave money laying around on all the desks and everything all the time. Sheesh. 
Gonna be running the big air compressor for the next hour, so I'll watch the stream tonight when you're done. Nay, no worries, my man. Thanks for being here. I greatly appreciate it, as always. Love it when you guys come to hang out. That's the whole point of the streams for me, to hang out with you folks. I find it so much better than uh, than just doing videos and that all the time. Like like I said, it, you know, if, I, if life was The Sims, my little diamond emerald bar gets filled up with you guys every time. It's awesome. Uh-oh. Oh. Why are we gonna go anyway? I can't exit. Now I know why. That well, PC's sticking out wide of it. Now, by uh, keeping the computers clean like this, you get higher scores from what I've been able to tell so far. Uh, cleaner, clean up debris. Alright. Let's grab our moonies. Now, I, I, know, I know my big fat head's in the way. You guys can't see it over here. But, uh, yeah, we got some monies here. We'll just collect everything first and... Fire! Oh. fire? Where? Where is there a fire? Jeez. There's no fire, pal. Quit screaming. The public place. All right, here. I'll get rid of my big fat head. We have uh, $112,730, so... I'm looking forward to the next update. We got some money to spend. Ah, oh, these people's shoes. Don't you know how to wipe your feet before you come in the build? Oh, we need like a welcome mat or something here so they can wipe their feet. You know, but I haven't like, I would say like X amount of uses before it gets destroyed. You know what I mean? So like say for every 25 customers, you got to replace it. It just gives you something to spend more of your, your money on, right? So, you know, as always, just trying to figure out ways to add values to the game. I mean, that, that that's what I was hired for. You know, that's what I moved up to in the gaming world was, you know, to take a look at things and say, okay, so here is an issue. How do we, you know, turn it into something that's, you know, fun, like a mini game, you know, things like that. But yeah, no, from from now on, as I was saying, I think I'm going to call all the demos and stuff I do, um, teardowns. It's not, you know, like I said, it comes from a place of love, doesn't come from a place, a place of hate. Uh, you know what I should do? Let's take a look and see what our marmalade were. Oh yeah, we're at four bucks. I want to do six bucks on those. Noodles. Hold on, you know what? Return. Let's reset the, yeah, okay, that's what I thought. All the prices are reset. We got to. We gotta change that. Return. Smackers. Uh, return. Spirita. Five. We gotta make at least two bucks on everything. Armalade. There we go. Return. Return. All right. Perfect. Now we'll start making a bit more cash. And we collected $23 on that. So now we can go to the store and grab ourselves a whole bunch more of uh, the goodies and items and fill up the vending machine. But let's see, we got, you know what? Uh, uh, I really want to just put you down, lay you flat. Uh, dude, Merlin just appeared out of nowhere. Yeah. Some collisions need to be added to the game. Alright, let's run home. We gotta keep her home life good. Oh, nope. Oh, that didn't quite work out like I planned. I wish the camera wouldn't turn around all the time. It's always doing that. Makes it hard for doing uh, maneuvers. Come here. Oh, for a second there. I was like, what happened to my fridge? Uh, open that. I wish we could buy more than... Uh, like, what is it, five Dr. Peppers a day, I think, is what the, the lap max is? I wish we could buy more. All 
Alright, so then we just place the rest of our goody good goodies in here. Oh, where am I going? And what do we have for food? Alright. It's kind of nice now that our happiness isn't dropping as fast as it used to, so the addition of these hot dogs is great. Oh, no worries, Eden. I totally understand that. Your puppers just start giving you those little puppy dogger eyes, and you just melt, and then you gotta give them love. I know all about it. I'm a dog lover myself. Still mourning for the loss of Hera. I mean, it's been over... It's uh, all of September, October, November, December, January. It's been five months. <sighs> Still not long enough. Still in mourning. <sighs> Alright. Like I said, a good spot would be right about here to put a garbage can. <laughs> um yeah i know you just run back and forth body hater uh you just run to like the gas station and then come back again yeah 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 it's still just a pain in the butt you know what i mean like i, I would much prefer just to uh just to have the ability to buy like a dozen per day or something like that like still have a limit on it but uh just have a little bit easier access to a bit more of a quantity see the the funny part is is that uh, i'm all about the dr pepper i mean my water bottle is a dr pepper <laughs> a two liter jug um up until about oh i'd say july of this year uh, one of the stores that's not that far from me uh, they used to have dr peppers on for a buck or no i guess it was it was before June. It was before my birthday. So let's just call it like May or something like that. But yeah, they used to carry two liters on for a buck. And so, I mean, I had a two liter a day habit. Like, that's just the way it was. <laughs> I see you over here. There we go. Don't have to have everything perfect. I might drive some of those with OCD up the wall, but yeah. I'm not I'm not a perfectionist in life. <laughs> you know, things will be will be. You know, don't sweat the things you can't control, you know, type type of person. Oh, oh, ladies and gentlemen, avert thy eyes. And once again, I'm pretty sure that actually I think that kind of missed this time, but uh, that's why we got this uh hand wand here. You just pull it out. Just give the whole tiled floor, the tiled walls, quick sh or shower, you know, it's waterproof toilet paper. We're fine. <laughs> yes, I did, Eden. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So, yeah, no, there's, uh, there's a lot to be said about, um, actually, I wonder now can we close this? Nope. See? So that, that's an oversight by the developer as far as I'm concerned. Um, this jerry can, if you put it in, you should be able to have the ability to rotate it on its, uh, in this case, that would be on the x-axis. So you could take it, rotate it flat, and then set it down so you can actually close the uh, trunk. Because right now, no matter what you do with the gas can, it is open. So to me, that's a bit of an oversight. So that would be something that I would, uh, if I was a program manager for this particular company, that I'd be going, hey, you know, we gotta, you know, we gotta work on that. Because, yeah, there's, there's no place of putting it without clipping. And if you clip in this car, you start going for a Mary Poppins ride. <laughs> the car just keeps on going up, 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 and away. So clipping into the trunk is not a good thing with this game. But you know what? It's late enough out at this point in time. Let's do this. Let's get our sleep on. But yeah, those are, you know, those are actually, you know, it's a pretty good tip, you know, for if you want to fill up on more items from the grocery store or from the uh, hot... I'll do it. From the grocery store or the hot dog vendor, you can just exit out, drive away. Not too far, actually. It's it's just a couple of, uh, as uh, Body Hater said, you know, just a couple meters and then reverse come back and then you can just buy even more um i was actually doing that here i'll show you what i was doing with that uh a while ago 
So we're going to need stuff for that second vending machine anyway. Might as well get it done. Remember, space bars break. <laughs> I keep forgetting that I closed the door. I'm so used to driving with the door wide open. All right. So this is what I normally do. Oh. Do I have my macro plugged in? Let's see. Let's use the macro plugged in. Oh, it is. Sweet. Love it when that happens. Make a laugh. It's so much easier. And it saves my mouse. Macros for the win. I Oh, um... So I keep saying macros like everybody knows exactly what I'm talking about. I have a, an orb weaver. So it's a extra peripheral control that uh, I can program to do that particular function. So it does all the tapping of the uh, R key for me. I don't have to do it all by myself. So let's put that like that, I guess. Do, 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 do. Take this one. This one I gotta put on its side. And we hope like heck that it doesn't do, uh, doesn't go flying. So then, yeah. So this is what I was doing previously. I drive out to here. And then back up again. I wouldn't go this far. <laughs> but, uh... I keep forgetting the space bar is the brake and camera. Quit flipping yourself. You're flipping me off. Alright. Out we go. And as you can see, everything's back again. Then you can rinse and repeat. But this time, you can hold everything in your hand. So I am really excited for this next update, guys. I mean, come on. That is a huge update. Now, when do I expect for it to come out? It is my guesstimate for the amount of work that he wants to put in. It looks like he's already got the items. Uh, looks like he's got a few assets already on the go. Like I said, he's got, looks like, two different color PSPs and a steering wheel set up. Um, so, to me, that's the easy part. So, with that being already ha done, uh, he has, what was that? Uh, let me just pull that back up again. He wants to have, in the next big update, uh, an expanded club building, new furniture, new items, new events, new NPCs, and a new club system. He's basically doing a heavy rewrite, so this could take anywhere from... Mm, depends on how much he's got done. I really wouldn't expect to see anything... You know, if he's got a majority of this done, I don't expect to see that happen until about the end of February possibly if he only has just what we've seen so far for the images of the upcoming updates it's probably going to be around the minimum of mid-may if he's got to do a major rewrite because you know every time you do a major rewrite you always get things that pop up bugs that you're just you didn't have before because some cross coding you know things like that so it all depends on how much he already has done but i would say yeah you know, best case scenario, end of February. Worst case scenario, mid-May. And that's if things do go very well for him in the coding process. I keep saying him for the develop, uh, for the dev. I should just say dev. Assuming gender G, what are you doing? Don't you know better? You can get canceled over that nowadays. <laughs> Alright. 
and so yeah this is the this is where the game grind comes in this is where you start doing a whole bunch of the 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 rinsing and repeating so and like that i have pretty much enough to start oh the camera flipped around again now i got pretty much enough to start sitting here and just grabbing an item putting it in grabbing an item putting it in then yeah just rinse and repeating making money while the store is open i'm just gonna put you over here for now what do you mean what did you just get your butt handed to you or were you not happy with the prices if you're not one happy with the prices then too bad did you not see that we're in the middle of a recession here you guys got to pay for those ultimate pcs that you're using eh? Yeah, there needs to be, we need to know like a way, like a pop-up or something on the machine, like, you know, in 95 customers, 65 bought something, you know what I mean? So we have an idea on how to price our, our items. We don't want to price ourselves out, but we would like to make some profits. You know, and so it'd be like, you know, you're only selling like, say, six chocolate bars, but you're selling like 900 of the juice boxes. Well, then you take a look at it and go, okay, I need to decrease the price of the, uh, the, the chocolate bars and I need to increase the price of the, of the, uh, instant noodles. Yeah. It's just, it's things like that, that, uh, you know, I, I really wish we're, we're in game now. These are things that, you know, can be, uh, da -da 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 -da. that can be added to the game. Uh, however, it all depends on the uh, developer's programming skills, on uh, being able to link everything up. Now, some programmers, the programmers that know how to, to like really do the code, like you know C++, for example, and stuff like that, they'd have an easier time of going in. Say this is a purchase asset from the Unity store, this vending machine, right? So say the developer didn't have anything to do with that. Everything was all pre-set up. Yeah, just depending on the development's developer's skill, they may not know how to change it so that way they can get those add-on information screens and things like those. Um, like, for example, saying, you know, uh, X amount of people bought this many sticker bars and this many people bought X amount of, you know, marmalades, you know, things like that. Like I said, it all depends on the skill of the, of the developer. Like, so if I go here, like, I should be able to click on the peach juice and then down here... It should say, you know, 16 purchase since the last restock. You know, and then to consider it a restock, it would be if you see an in number of two or more. Because, you know, every once in a while, one falls out and you put it in there, right? And then, you know, somebody's going to buy it before the next one falls down. So it just gives them that extra programming. So it's an if, then, and, and, or programming set. And I do not know many programmers today that are using Unity that know how to do that um i would say that there's more chance of people on the uh, unreal engine that are more experienced with games and stuff like that that would be able to that would do be able to do that to take up the challenge of what i'm speaking oh i can't wait as well um eden so how are you guys going to announce it you're going to do a little video for uh, uh like a blue firework or a, per a pink firework <laughs> that would be awesome all right so hunger's good urine's good oh do we not have any juice here oh my oh my well we're gonna have to go buy some juice for the store because i need to have some juice here i'm just going to eat spam and drink juice at the store or at the uh the club that's my goal. And then when I'm at home, I get my Dr. Pepper's juice and, uh... I get one Dr. Pepper a day. That's it. Whee! I'm trying to... Oh, whoops. <laughs> trying to, um... Work the car a little bit and see if we can get the temperature up. I have never seen the temperature up in this game. So, I, I want to know... I want to know how to do it because... You open up the hood... But you can mess with the oil cap here and you can mess with the radiator cap so I'm guessing the radiator cap is functional it's just I've never never had any high temperatures nice Eden nice you guys already got it figured out so you've been in the you've been through the discussion and uh 
uh, negotiation stage. <laughs> oh, come on. Do I really need two, two baskets for that? Uh, whoops, I did that wrong. Come on. You, come here. I keep trying to use the mouse wheel to scroll. It's just, it's a natural feeling to use it. All right, you know what I'm going to try? I'm going to try running away and coming back myself. And you know what? I'm really sick and tired of that dollar dollar bill y'all always sticking up behind me. I don't look good in brown. I got red hair. <laughs> yeah, it was far enough. All right, so you just need to run down to the street corner there, folks, and then come back yourself. I thought you had to take the car. I've always taken the car. Look at that. You learned something new. More tips for you. More tips. For the latest tips and tomfoolery, subscribe now! Smoke starts coming out of the hood and car stops. Depending on where it stops, might be annoying to run to shop and get some more coolant. Gotcha. Oh, yeah, come on. It's a time to celebrate, right? Especially if it's your first one. Yep, if it's, your, if it's your first, and then it's uh, it's a pretty big deal. And then the second one comes around, you're going, oh, why did we do this? <laughs> Just kidding. We already had one. But mind you, I only have the one, so I mean, I spoil the living hell out of him. He's my, he's my squirt. He's my caveman. Love him to pieces and spoil him to death. At the same time, try to educate him in the ways of the world. To think open-mindedly. Yeah. Look before he leaps. Looks both ways before he crosses the street. Yeah. Clean up his mess if he tinkles when he... Or if he sprinkles when he tinkles. <laughs> you know. All that stuff. Here right now, if he's watching the stream later, he's going, Dad! Oh, I, I got a, I got a, I got a, a quote here that, uh, I, was it a quote or a rhyme or a rhythm? I don't know what you want to call it. No, I ain't got no rhythm. Um, but anyway, it, it goes, uh, if you tinkle when you sprinkle, be a sweetie, wipe the seedy. You know, that, that was something that, that, you know, was, was, and I taught him, you know, like, dude, you know what? You know, you're a big boy, and, you know. If you tinkle when you sprinkle, or if you sprinkle when you tinkle, be a sweetie, wipe the CD, and he just, Dad, like what? <laughs> and he, he just does not like it when I say it. Dad, it's so embarrassed. Just plan on spoiling the kiddo. Definitely not going to do something that would cause stress and anxiety from during the pregnancy. Gotcha. Don't drink the gasoline. Yeah, no doubt, no doubt. That would be that would be oh, absolutely horrendous to accidentally do. In life, like, oh. Don't do it. It's not, it's not consumptionable. It is not food grade. <laughs> don't siphon gas tank, kids. Now, I don't know if it's on YouTube or not, because I don't look up this type of stuff, but there is a way to siphon gas safely. My dad taught us that when we were kids. Because working on the, the farm, right? So... My dad's like, hey, 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 don't be sucking the fumes out of that hose. And then he showed us how to do it the correct way. He's like, oh, well, that's, that's ingenious. That works well. All right. Thanks, Dad. And I've siphoned many, uh, uh, many of a jerry can that the, you know, the spouts, the old yellow spouts. Well, before we had the, the flexible ones, we used to have these, they were almost like a pink color. And if they got out in the sun for more than a week... You just touch them on anything and they just shatter. So, yeah. There was many a times that I was sitting there siphoning fuel into my motorbike. So that way I could go out there and move wheels in the morning. Ugh. Feed the animals. Depending on the time of year. Clean the pen. Not just so... I, I have realized now in life why I say foul is foul. 
like why I just don't like chickens. It's because I had to take care of them when I was younger. You're collecting the eggs, redoing all the nestings, redoing all the boxes, fighting off the geese. Especially, oh my god, if they were here. If they were on egg, oh man, if they were on egg, forget it. Forget it. Just don't even go anywhere near them. Get the noise. Conk, conk, conk. Oh. And then you get the rest of the brood coming after you, picking at your legs and everything. Like, there's a reason why my legs are so white in life. <laughs> I had ducks. I couldn't wear shorts as kids. Yeah, real life socks. <laughs> yep. <laughs> But yeah, no, I think that's one of the main reasons why I'm just, I'm not a big fan of chicken now. Like eating chicken is just like, oh, do I have to? And like, I will not eat chicken from KFC or any restaurants or anything. It's, I got to cook it myself. Like I just, I just can't do it. It's like, all right, if I'm going to eat chicken, then I'm going to have to enjoy eating it. So that means I got to make it my way. But I've had loads of practice cooking in my lifetime. So I found recipes that I like for chicken just not very many i like the the roasted kind i like the deep fried kind and and uh, th th that's about it uh there's some barbecue not really that much um if i'm gonna do barbecue it's like barbecued wings but you know I, i'm not a big fan of barbecuing chicken breast unless i'm going to use it in like a, a chicken caesar wrap or something one second All right, didn't think you guys wanted to hear me clear that flamball. Wait. Oh, end of day, end of day. Time to go home, time to go home. Here, I'll close the door for all those. <laughs> you keep driving with the door open. Sorry. I just, it's pointless. There's, there's no repercussion for driving with the door open. You know what I mean? Like, oh, besides, sure, it's a pain in the butt. <laughs> Are you telling me I can't get out? There you go. All right. Bone, how you doing, man? I'm looking forward to tomorrow. I got something to... What do you mean you don't want to sleep, pal? Oh, all right. Well, fine. We'll take care of your necessities. Hello? Anybody in here? Okay, it's me. All right, look away, children. Oh, hey, I actually got near the bowl this time. <laughs> uh, let's see your needs. Uh, Turst. All right. Might have to buy some more juice tomorrow for the house. Oh. <laughs> Bone says, why do you always let a woman go through the door first? <laughs> Snipers. <laughs> um, something is going on tomorrow. Uh, uh, tomorrow, I am going to go get some groceries. This is IRL. I'm going to get uh, uh, some groceries tomorrow and uh, disinfect it and everything else and get my house completely cleaned up as best as I can and disinfected because caveman's going to be here uh so far the plan is Friday night unless the um the ex has got to, to work late so but she's she's hoping so far that nope that uh you know she won't have to work late I'm just gonna put you there quit messing around and take one of you there's a nom 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 noms all right close door thank you now is my guy tired? There we go. But I'm pretty sure you guys don't really want to watch stocking mach uh, vending machine simulator and all that. Plus we got tons and tons of money on me. So what I might do between now and the next update video for this game. Because there's really not much that we can do. I mean, come on. Really, I mean... We haven't even gotten our disposal bin full here, so... Our trailer. So yeah, I'm thinking that we'll have to wait until... Uh, the next update. Uh, so we can do some more things. Now, who knows? With that next update, we might have to restart again. If that's the case, that's alright. The game's in early access. That that happens. 
sorry I had to step away for work. Everything, <laughs> missed everything that I was said about you. <laughs> How dare work get in the way of your gaming time, right? Your your entertainment time. <laughs> so yeah, tomorrow, like I said, I'm going to go uh, grocery shopping, get some disinfectant, completely clean up the house. So that might push me over the edge with my fibro. It, like I'm, I'm doing a little bit better right at the moment, but with this coughing and everything else, it just it gets worse without the day. And if I go into a full-blown flare with these kidney stones, it usually lays me out pretty good. So I'm hoping the worst case scenario will be a Friday stream. Uh, if not, I'll be back on Thursday if everything goes well. But uh, those are my plans, folks. This has been another awesome uh, play play up. Another playthrough of the uh, My Gaming Club. I've been loving this game, guys. I've really been enjoying it. Other than the constant stocking of the vending machines. But hey, we're making the monies this way. I mean, we just got ourselves another 88 bucks out of there for just, you know, stocking machines. So, I mean, come on. Who can complain about getting paid for that? So, I think this is where we are going to end things, folks, so that way I don't overdo it. So that way, hopefully, it gives us the best chance uh, to come back tomorrow in a, a healthy shape. Why? Oh, I guess it would help if I pressed the right button. But, uh, yeah. As always, guys, thank you so much for being here. You guys have been absolutely awesome. As uh, a huge shout out to all those amazing channel members here. We got Eba, Shane, Indigo, William, Karsten, Spider at Little Mac, Devin, Any64, Sam, Jack, Bob, Lean Dirt, Ao Mike, Zona, Noah, Douglas, Eden, Bud, Humanist, Bailey, William, Martin, Zach, Richard, and the one that I haven't gotten to is Ian. So thank you for being the newest one. Um, thank you to Ebas for doing the donation of the. Uh, of the uh, subscriptions to the channel, so or the memberships to the channel. So thank you for your support, no matter where you are in the world today, folks. I hope you have yourself a wonderful morning, evening, afternoon, good night. Thank you for taking the time to kick back, relax, unwind with me, and I'll see you guys in the next one.